No filter with Paul and Phil in. Paul, what are we doing today? <laughs> Where's Grady? I don't know. So we have a great show today. We're at General Steam. It's about 15 miles west of Vail. Oh. Yeah. This place was founded by Leroy Albert Wilson back in the 20s. So it's about 90 years old. Was he excommunicated? Leroy Wilson was excommunicated. He defended polygamy till his death. Matter of fact, in one account that we read, his daughter, Margaret, wrote that her dad would bribe her with silver dollars because when he wanted to bring on another wife, the whole family was upset. And the original mother right. wanted to divorce him. So this guy is a real character in American history. Steampunk. Yeah, he's. <laughs> I guess he's the original steampunk because he built efficient steam engines. Oh. So what he did is he came, he was born in Midvale, Utah, and he came south and he came here and this is where he built some steam engines to mine ore and gold and he'd bring investors from all over the world and not one of them ever received a return on their investment oh, did he bring this walnut tree from midville yeah this this walnut tree is probably about 90 years old and there's a lot of fruit trees around here too matter of fact come check this out i want to show you an apple tree paul we are in the garden of general steam look at these apples so got a couple little crab apples here let me try that he might die. That is sour. It's actually kind of good, a little bit tart. So there's a couple of accounts yes. that this guy in the 20s and 30s was driving a steam car that he built around St. George. And he was known for that. Did he go in the parades in St. George? <laughs> Maybe, but this guy had a steam car and he drove it around St. George. And this was one of the things that he used to entice investors oh. that, he could, that he could mine ore more efficiently than other operations. General Steampunk Wilson. We are in the luscious garden of General Steam, founded by Leroy Wilson. He chose this place because of how green it was and how much dirt there was to help with the steam engines and to power them because we all know steam engines run on dirt. So Paul, much like your shorts, Leroy's legacy was short-lived. <laughs> That's right. How long did Leroy live? You know, Leroy was born in 1892 and he died in 1854, so he lived about 62 years, but he was murdered in Kanab. In Kanab? Oh yeah, cold-blooded murder. He was shot several times. Jeez. So what happened was is the government was paying more for uranium than they were for gold. And what was uranium used for? Atomic bombs. Boom. And this is where the trommel and the ball mill was located. So a few years ago when I came here, there was this great big wheel thing. And that's where they would take the larger pieces and separate them from the smaller pieces, the, the quartz. And then they would put it through the ball mill, which would crush it into like a fine powder and like smaller, tiny, tiny pebbles. And then they would take that up here to the smelter. And that's where they would refine it. Paul, I found feathers. There's like just tons of cool old things. Ooh metal rod. You can make your own steampunk engine. But you can tell that they use this as a smelter and this is where they heated stuff up because here's a brick that they would use in a kiln. Yeah. And this is heavy. This is probably some of the, there's a pile over there where they got the, I, the ore, the iron. I, iron. And these are quartz where they get gold. Paul, Leroy built two houses, one for his help and another for his family. Warehouses, a large cellar and animal pens. Yeah, he was a real entrepreneur. Huge. Paul, I've never been up here before. Yeah. It's a pretty cool place. <laughs> this place is cool. So anything that has to do with a guy that was born in the 1800s is cool to me. It's still cool. Yeah, I have his hat. Okay, so this guy was an inventor. He invented efficient steam engines. He was a polygamist. He was excommunicated from his church he and was, he was murdered. It's like a whole life. <laughs> hey, follow us on Instagram, like us on Facebook. Bring your family out here. General Steam is a place to come and find treasures. And hats. Kids will love it. When you hear the crash, think of Jones Paint, Jones Paint, and last. What seems to be the problem, officer? Is that pina colada? Strawberry? Boys and birds in the way. That's snozzberries. 
It's like Christmas and Valentine's got together and Easter was born in here. Actually, it's a custom blend that we had made for us at Cloud9 Vapor. Those boys were all right. 